I'd now like to show you how to download the DNR GPS application. Now this is useful for collecting data in the field, walking trails or collecting points, and then downloading those in a format that's compatible with a lot of different data uh, manipulation programs. In particular, you can download shape files, which then we can input into a GIS, such as Map Window GIS. Um, now there's a couple of things. There used to be a version called um, DNR Garmin and if you go to search that or somebody tells you about that this is the successor version it's DNR GPS so you'll get directed to this www.dnr.state.mn.us miss GIS DNR GPS DNR GPS .html. it might be easier than typing it into to, to just do a web search on MN DNR space DNR GPS and you'll get to this page now if you look, there's a set here on downloading the programs, a set of links, known issues. One of the things that you'll need to do, for the most part, most of you will need to do, is download this .NET 4 framework. And so that's good to just download already. It clicks you to a site, a Microsoft site, and then you download it and um, run automatically and install. It's a good thing to do because the... DNR GPS is dependent on having this installed and running on your program. Now, on your computer. Now, here I'm doing showing you how to do it to a Windows XP version. It also works in Windows 7 and perhaps other versions of Windows. Now, I had a moderately slow connection, and it's just finishing about a minute and a half of downloading time. Uh, so, once it's done downloading, it'll ask you, do you want to run the software? And you'll say, sure and it'll go ahead and install it. Okay, once it uh, has finished its long install, you'll uh, get another screen telling you the installation is complete and you can go ahead and finish it. Now once you've finished installing the .NET Framework 4, you can go back to the DNR GPS application main page and you can download the program. Now depending upon your browser or the internet speed, it, how these following screens show may differ and how long it takes may differ. So I'll left click here and it'll ask you do you want to open or save this file. I'm going to say go ahead and save it. I'm asking you where I want to save it. So I'll go to my computer. Let's go folks. Um, to my local C drive to my program files. I'll go ahead and save this DNR GPS there. And here it's going to approximately take 15 seconds it says. And once it's done, I can go ahead and close out of this and navigate to my documents here on, this looks a little funny, my C drive, program files. And I want to go ahead and show the contents. And down in here, I should have this DNR GPS. And I'll right click and extract all. And it's going to go into this program files DNR GPS directory and then I'll finish. So there I have then this DNR GPS and there's a bunch of supporting files inside this directory. I can just go ahead and double left click on it. First time it'll ask me am I sure I want to run it? And now we're off and running. Now you can load this to your start um, pop-up menu here or you can put the icon down in your toolbar or you can just find out uh, where it is and always navigate to it but that's all there is to it